Princess Diana's tragic death in 1997 has forever linked her to controversial Playboy Dottie Fade with royal experts wanting more for her than that. Dottie Fade and the Princess of Wales first met back in 1986 during a polo match in Windsor when he and Prince Charles were on opposite teams. The meeting was said to be just a formal introduction in which they exchanged pleasantries. In 1997, Mr. Fade's father, Muhammad Al Fade invited Diana and her sons, Princes William and Harry, to spend a holiday on board his yacht in the south of France. After she agreed, pictures of Mr. Fade and the princess kissing were published all around the world. Amazon Prime's 2017 documentary Princess Diana, behind the headlines discusses the public reaction upon learning Diana was dating the controversial playboy. Jess Cagle, People magazine editor claims Diana needed serious security and a certain kind of life. Mr. Cagle adds, so she famously started dating Dottie Fade. Kim Hubbard, books editor at People claims, he, Dottie, was a playboy. He didn't have a very good reputation for being dubstandy. Dan Wakeford, deputy editor at People suggests, he was a party animal. Mr. Wakeford suggests the public reaction was not so good with claims that people were initially excited to see Diana happy that she was dating again after photographs of her and Princess William and Harry on Doty's yacht were published. However, Ems Hubbard claims that after learning who the man was, the reaction didn't sound so good. Ems Hubbard then goes on to say, So when we wrote the story we're all hoping, I really hope this is not her. We wanted more for her than that. Dottie Fade was a regular at the Notorious Studio 54 in the early 1980s where he was known as fan of good quality coke and hot women according to a memoir by the club's owner, Mark Fleischman. In his book Inside Studio 54 published in 2017, Mr. Fleischman claims that Mr. Fade was a member of what he called the Dawn Patrol, a group of celebrities who would take copious amounts of party drugs, engage in anonymous sex in the club and would scour the town in limousines for illegal parties open in New York at 5 a.m. Mr. Fade enjoyed a very privileged upbringing, too. Not only was he the eldest son of billionaire Egyptian tycoon and former Herod's owner Mohammed Al Fade, but his mother was the sister of the Saudi Arabian arms dealer Adnan Khashoggi, who was a billionaire as well. His family also owned the Ritz Hotel in Paris which is the last place he and Diana were together just before the fatal crash. He was in the car with Princess Diana when it crashed and killed them both in Paris, 1997. On the night she died, Diana was traveling with her companion through the Pont d'Alma tunnel when their vehicle crashed into a pillar. Diana was transported to the Salpetriere hospital where she died of her injuries. Mr. Fade was pronounced dead at the scene.